Do you have a dead computer fan? It is connected to a power supply and it just doesn't want to go. It tries, but it just doesn't want to go. Well, the problem is it simply needs some oil. So you can fix this fan rather than replacing it. It's very simple. I'm going to disconnect it. Okay. And now we're going to go ahead and if there's a grill or it's mounted in your computer or what have you, just take the four screws out. Now these screws kind of bite into the plastic, so you want to make sure you use an appropriately sized screwdriver. Don't use a drill or any powered tool on this because you stand the risk of cracking the plastic and then you won't have four screws mounting it anymore if it had four to begin with. Some are only mounted with two. So we'll remove that, take that off, and now what we have is a sticker. We have to get rid of that. Use a utility knife, something like this will work and you want to go ahead and peel off this sticker. So we'll just kind of slip under that and peel it back until we can grab it ourselves. Now this one had a rubber plug. Some may have a, another sticker over it or some other thing to prevent entry into the area that we're interested in, which is right here. Um, Usually a utility knife will take care of that. Now you need some oil. Now what kind of oil to use? Well, you can use Zoom Spout, you can use 3-in-1 oil, you cannot use WD-40. WD-40 will only work for a very short time and you'll be doing this repair again within about a week or so. I happen to use this. There is a special one for motors in a blue can, but this is what I have on hand. We're going to put some oil in the center of this couple of drops, maybe three. Set that aside. And I'm going to take the black plug off and go ahead and re-plug the hole. There we are. And we'll put the sticker back. It doesn't matter really which way it goes. That's fine there. The fan is probably not going to work immediately. Let's plug it in and see if we did anything. Not just yet, but we're going to spin it, and it's a little sluggish, but it's picking up. I'll put it this way, and pretty much it needs to kind of run in for a while. It's actually picking up speed now. It's getting better and better. And there we are. You can probably hear the airflow. This is a pretty quiet fan, but it seems to be running well. Another trick you can use is some compressed air to blow the blades. That works. Or you can just work it by hand for a while. This one happened to not be so bad, so it kind of just spun up right away uh, with just no more than a hand shove. I'll go ahead and disconnect it. It still kind of stalls kind of quick, so... It is going to need some time to work in. But it starts right back up when I plug it in. So this fan will probably work itself in in time and be just fine. Now you can just put everything back and put it back in service and it's ready to go. Hopefully that helped you out. Thanks for watching. Make sure you click like. Make sure you click subscribe. And take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.